love with the bands Every time she wanna wanna see me when she can, yeah, yeah. Cause I'm the man with the plan The way she scream my name, you could swear she's a fan I don't wanna trouble with my Zanku Maybe tryna see what the bands do Maybe why what you Hi guys Today, I'm just gonna be real with you guys. I, I just didn't wanna drop anything. I didn't even wanna um, do any YouTube videos this week. I just wanted to take some time for myself. And I just wasn't really feeling up to it. I wasn't really feeling myself. I had a lot of things on my mind. I was spending this whole week kind of reflecting on myself, on my mission and I was feeling a bit overwhelmed. And um, so normally, like in my last video, that self um, routine, self care routine, you know, I write things down, um, you know, I take some time for myself. And at first it just wasn't, it wasn't doing anything. So I recorded how I was feeling um, and then I took some time out as well and then today i woke up quite happy i did i woke up quite happy and then i was just slightly feeling quite down again and i was meant to post another video today but i just felt like let me post this this video just about the realness of being an entrepreneur sometimes there's no one pushing you you don't have deadlines like from a manager from a teacher or something like that that you know someone's going to get onto you kind of thing this is all you setting this up for yourself so these are deadlines that you have to do for yourself you have to be consistent you have to pick yourself up like it's only you and you have to strengthen yourself to do the things that you need to do and you know sometimes that does become a bit heavy and a lot of the times i was thinking so many things in my head and i, I was feeling um like i don't know like just overwhelmed like i just felt a bit negative but my feelings were up and down up and down because i've got good things going on in my life then i've got some stuff that's coming in left right and center and then i've got deadlines and then i've got stuff like that i'm want to experiment in but then what i did do which kind of uplifted my spirits and made me want to actually do a video about just being real with myself before my hands were dry there um about being real with myself was because I went back to my mission statement and someone gave me a good idea. I don't know if I read it in a book, but to write your mission statement, like what is your purpose as a human being? And you know, certain jobs and stuff like that, they have mission statements, visions, blah, blah, blah. And you're a part of that vision to create their business or whatnot. So they, so I did one for myself about what's my mission? What is, what is it that I want to accomplish? What is it that I want to do in this lifetime? And I went back to my vision statement and my mission statement and one of my declarations and it just boosted my spirit as in this is why I'm doing this because sometimes it gets heavy you know you just want to sit down watch Netflix sometimes you just want to you know what this is a bit too much you know let me just stick to my J-O-B like this is a lot of, lot of work but when you go back to your mission statement when you go back to the reason of why you're actually doing what you're doing then it boosts you up to continuously do what you need to do and I think even mentoring as well is a very um it's a very very powerful thing not just for the other person my mentees are receiving but for me myself because then I I see them as someone that I have to be a role model for and I have to continuously be strong and I have to continuously be able to give back to them so that gives me a boost as well as in like I've got people looking at me or and stuff like that so it keeps me strong and sometimes when you begin your journey you you question yourself like why are people coming to me like I shouldn't really be mentoring I haven't really got to where I need to get to blah 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 but along the journey you've picked up so much information that you're able to feed back to the people that are coming to you for um mentoring mentorship and all of that stuff and this morning I had like three calls three calls um and I was I wasn't really feeling top level like I usually do but because they're relying on me because they they want information that I have I had to be strong and I had to give back and during that time of giving back and feeding them the information I'm like yes 
this is my purpose and everybody may have different purpose but my purpose is is as i grow i will give back to the people that are close to me and my community information knowledge wisdom and understanding days like this where you just feel like <sighs> really <laughs> you just feel like i just want to chill i just want to do this i just want to do this but then crown girl the crown is heavy you got to build the muscles you got to build the muscles in order for you to get through this day but definitely documenting my journey is a beautiful experience and even as i'm even doing this video it's uplifting me as well and being consistent like i really didn't want to drop anything but i was like girl you got to be consistent and plus i've got subscribers that are waiting for a video on wednesday so i really need to provide them with that content so my message today is that sometimes it's, it's not easy sometimes you do feel down sometimes you do feel like you know you're comparing yourself to other people like some of the phone calls i had today with my mentees is like sometimes you're comparing yourself to other people that are around you but there's gifts that only you have there's talents that only you have you know the unique selling point is you you know and that's and that's what you have to do and you have to take care of the flocks that are gathered towards you or the people that have come to you those are the people you have to take care of you can't look at someone else's grass or go and look at someone else's flocks when you've got flocks right in front of you that are looking at you to be you know their inspiration so sometimes it does get hard sometimes it does get a bit heavy but take time breathe like i did today i breathed um but yeah i just did what i needed to do to get me back to this point and i was meant to film a, a video about how i invest in properties and stuff like that but i will be releasing that on sunday just to give you guys some good information some good content in regards to that and i am gonna be doing a masterclass on what i've learned so far in the rent to rent industry so i will be leaving a link in the description box for people to sign up um, if you will be interested in that if you are interested in the real journey of how i got into properties and how i started investing with the strategy of rent to rent so thank you guys for watching i know this is one is, is very short and sweet um but thank you guys for the support and everything that you guys have been doing sharing my videos liking my videos commenting on my videos messaging me and inspiring me and the noise in the background is the pigeons because my grandma likes to feed the pigeons and they come in flocks <laughs> and when they get scared they just scatter and this is my studio shed it's very shallow and you can just hear them just doing a madness but anyway thank you for watching please do subscribe if you haven't already and i shall see you soon